Hi, this is a video to show you the features that are hidden in a Schoology discussion post. Assuming that you have your discussion post in a course and it has a due date, you should be able to find it underneath the upcoming column. If it doesn't have a due date, you're going to have to navigate and find it in your material section. Go ahead and open your discussion post and click on the settings wheel and click on edit. When you click on edit, you can manipulate or edit anything that's in the discussion post. You can add a due date and a time. You can enable grading. You can align standards. And you can also publish to students so students can see it. You can individually assign to specific students. And this is the feature that we're going to focus on today is you can change how the student responds in the Schoology post. So for example, if you post a discussion post and you want the student to comment before being able to see anybody else's comments, you will change the way this icon looks. So right now the icon is colorful. It's like a little cap and gown guy. It's colorful. That means a student, when they go into Schoology, open up the discussion post, they will not be able to see other students' posts or even the teacher's posts if you commented on this discussion post. You, they will not be able to see any posts until they comment. If you would prefer students to be inspired by what other students say and to get some ideas off of what other students say, then you want that feature to be grayed out. Um, that means that when a student opens up the discussion post, they can read through and reply to other discussion comments before they actually comment on their own. So let me kind of show you what that looks like. So I'm gonna save these changes. I'm gonna come over to a sample course. Now this isn't a live active course, so I have a sample student in here, but in your course, you can do the same thing and view the course as any student that is in your course. So I have my sample student here, and I am viewing the course as the sample student. I can't interact with it, like I can't post anything, I can't submit anything, I can just view the course as what the student would see. I'm gonna come over to my upcoming tab, find the discussion post, and go down to the bottom. So if you remember, we had the icon grayed out, which means that I can comment, I can reply, I can like, before I actually comment. And I can see what other people have said. If you wanted to see what that looks like when they have to reply first, I'm gonna come back to my discussion post. I'm gonna to go to the settings wheel. I'm going to edit the post and I am going to make that icon colorful. So now students will not be able to see what other students or teachers have responded. They can't like, they can't reply um, to anything in the discussion post until they comment. So view course as, my sample student again. I'll come back over to my discussion post. And now as you can see, everything is grayed out. I can't like it, I can't reply until I comment on my own. I hope this video helps you understand the features of a Schoology discussion post.